All right, this is something I had to do a little redesign on. So I actually modified the other ones for the Alohas, and I had to do a little modification for the Chow, the Chow Bella, and the Bonjour 260 Extended. So these are my roll-ups. So I like these things. What I do is I actually recycle the bags. So you have your Q bags and your B bags. Regardless of what balloons you use, the, the plastic on the, the B bags are much better. It's a much softer plastic. They're not that crunchy stuff. And they hold up a lot better over time. So what you do is basically you load, I've got a video that shows you how to load these tubes back up. So I will usually stock about 100 260s in one of these bags. This is a four pack. So I always, I have the 10, the 12, and the 15, which are for the Alohas. And this is actually a smaller version. So it's, it's a little bit shorter, which allows your balloons to flare out. So you get that pop effect. One of the things I am doing on all of them as I am putting some elastic bands. This one has one, but the rest of them will have two. So this elastic band just is attached to the, to the roll-up. This comes down and, and off. So that stays there permanently. And this one is basically just a four pack. Now, it's not the prettiest of things. I didn't actually do this. This is more functional. And I was trying to find the right pieces I need. Um, sometimes the markets in Kathmandu are a little bit hard to find like the good quality stuff, but I ended up finding something I can use. I tend to repurpose a lot if I can. So what we have here is this is actually a fabric that's used for um, like garter belts, I believe. It's um, kind of what you put around like a back brace kind of thing with big Velcro. So it's very elasticy, but also very strong. I use that. Not really fond of the colors, but on the other hand, you stick it inside your bag, nobody ever sees it. So it's, it's something internal. So if you, if you have a nice car, go, somebody goes, hey, can I see the oil filter? It's like, you don't do that. You look at the car, the car looks nice. Granted, it's got the technical stuff inside that's very important and that's what you need. That's what this is, but it doesn't have to look pretty. So you've got your four pack. So there's a whole technique I have and I will make a video of that probably when I get home as far as loading these and then pulling the plastic bag down through the bottom, leaving the flare up on the top. And then basically you just roll that up, take that little elastic band, flip that down and around. Now, another thing that this has, and this is especially designed for the, the Chow and the Chow Bella, is you actually have a strip of Velcro. Now, you have a vertical strip of Velcro here. On inside the Chow and the Chow Bella, you have two horizontal lines of Velcro. So what that will do is that will slide in and that will actually attach to the front wall of your, uh, your Chow or your Chow Bella. And what that does is as your balloons de deplete and they're getting a little bit thin, these are not just gonna fall over. So you wanna have that nice flare, that nice presentation of all those balloons sticking out the top at all times. You don't wanna like get through halfway through your gig and your balloons are flopping around and you can't see and then you're digging through your bag, no. That's what problem I had with um, a lot of the Velcro roll-ups. That's why I never went to, to roll-ups before the manufacturers did. A lot of times you're using the Velcro and you take some half the balloons out and all your balloons are starting to fall down to the bottom. That doesn't happen with this. So this, this is really good, keeps all the balloons up, keeps them nice and straight works well. So that's the four pack roll up.